Hey everybody, I'm Crow, and welcome to Slay the Spire. We've got like four or five days until the new Shovel Knight game comes out, so it'd be awkward to start anything big. And I was going through my Steam list and I noticed that uh, four and a half years ago I put three hours into this game and then never touched it again. So probably as good a time as any. The Ironclad. 80 HP, 99 gold. The remaining soldiers of the Ironclad sold his soul to harness demonic energies. Burning blood. At the end of combat, heal 6 HP. 4 unlocks remaining. 70 HP as opposed to the 80. Same amount of gold. Deadly Huntress from the Foglands eradicates foes with daggers and poison. At the start of each combat, draw two additional cards. That sounds a lot stronger, but I don't remember... Ah, that, that's almost 10% of their max health. I guess we'll do Assassin. Hello again. Choose. Obtain a random card. So this is like a card-based thing. I remember that, but I don't really remember much else. We move from location to location trying to get to the end. And there's a boss at the end of each thingy? Uh, obtain a relic, I guess. It's like a passive effect, right? Instead of a card. Granted. I don't know what it did, but it looks like we can choose between either one of these and we can kind of map the, the route out ahead of time. Holy cow, that's really long. I was not... okay. Okay. They curl and hop. I think it tells us what they do beforehand, player turn first. So block would block five of their stuff, this would do six stuff, they're gonna hit me for fourteen. Oh, and that's the cost up on the top. So I think I hit them. Oh, cool, it does it real time. I kill them. Weaken creatures do less damage. Wait, did I mess up? Did it not kill them? I was, okay. I think I missed. I was intending to kill one of them and then defend. That didn't pan out. Hmm. Rep. And turn. Oof. Oh, do we do spiky damage to them or something? They took three, and we have a little star for three down there. Very good. Aid block, but discard a card. That, that kind of covers things. I wonder if I should use a mouse instead. Would that make a significant difference? Oh, they had a shield. That's why they didn't die that other time. Okie doke. So, I will survive an eight and get rid of this defense. Now, you will not be able to harm me. And also, you will die. Because spiky damage. Dead. 20G. A weak potion. Applies weak. Add a card to your deck. Okay, draw cards until you have six in your hand for only one. That's pretty cool. Deal eight damage, draw a card. That's amazing. All enemies lose six strength this turn. Exhaust. Strength adds additional damage to attack. So does that just reduce the damage that everything does by six? If there's three enemies, that's, that's a potential of 18 damage. Removed until the end of combat. I really love both of these. But I think since enemies have 12 health, that's not going to do a heck of a lot for me. I'm going to go with Piercing Whale. That seems good. Oh, and I have a potion. Oh, they're, they're ranked on the side. So elites have big horns. Thorns. I assume that's what our thingy does, or maybe it's the snake ring. I don't honestly know how to check. So, I think we just stick to some stat- Oh, wait, 42. Are we already in problems? That is- that is a mountain of damage. You get the aid, and then... Throw away a defense? And turn. 
Alright, so we only took three damage, but we gave them the extra three that they hit us with. Is that a, is that a debuff? Are they gonna burn me or something? Apply three, deal three damage and apply weak. Neutralized. And it costs zero, that's pretty awesome. That doesn't look like it's going to do damage to me, because there's no number, so I think we don't use these, because then they don't go into discard or something? That could be entirely wrong. I'm not entirely sure how system works. System, please work. So that'll break the block. What does the 10 in the block mean? The 10, 10 sword damage block? The 10 it pierces block? I'm going to use this and I'm going to use this and we're going to find out if that still does 10 damage to me. Science! Okay. It gave them block after they attacked. I don't know if it was the same 10. They got hit for 3. I think it might have given them 8. Or however much we... I probably didn't take it all. That's fine. So we'll do 6 damage. Then we will do 6 damage. And we will weaken them. Negating their bonus damages. And there's no need to block. We still got our 60 HP. She's pretty strong. I look like there was room for a bunch of extra heroes, but I only have three hours game time. And I haven't played it in four and a half years. So, uh... Holy cow. Removed until end of combat. So this isn't forever and always. In which case, I will remove six of your strength. Making that only eleven. And then we... Drop that by another three. Oh, but it gives them three armor. We were the ones giving them the armor. And then defense. And a regular defense, I guess. If I don't have a card to discard, can I still use that? We'll have to see. Too bad for them, though, dead. I don't think we took any damage. Piercing Wheel. All enemies lose another... for poison. Poison creatures lose HP at the start of their turns. Each turn, poison is reduced by one. So four poison means four damage, but it's to all enemies, and it takes four turns for it to happen. But it also costs two. I want that to be good, but I don't think we have enough poison stacking stuff to make that worthwhile. I want another one of these. have muns. Let's go here. Maybe we buy something fancy. Okay. Deal 12 damage whenever you play a card this turn. The enemy loses 3 HP. Oh. So if you had a bunch of zero cost cards, that'd be cool. Gain 5 block, draw 2 cards. This is just a better better defense. 25. Oh, that's, that's expensive. I didn't realize that some of these were ridiculously... Oof. Next turn, gain two green triangles. Is that, uh... Oh, energy. Energy is used to play cards from your hand. Thank you. Thank you, helpful tutorial stuff. Draw three cards, but get exhausted. Or no, exhaust removes until end of combat, so you can only play this card once. Creatures take 50% more damage from attacks. Two vulnerable means two turns. So... I kind of like this. Wait, what do these do? Every three turns, gain flower. The happy flower. Is that a Plants vs. Zombies reference? Start a combat, draw two additional cards. Cards with exhaust when played will instead discard 50% of the time. Ooh. Liquid bronze, gain three thorns. Whenever receiving attack damage, deals damage back. I think these are consumable, though. Discard any number of cards, then draw that many. Gain five decks at the end of your turn, lose five decks. We'll get the backflip. I like the backflip. We're good now. Goodbye. As you walk into the room, 
you hear a gurgling and the grinding of metals. Before you is a slime-like creature that ate too much scrap for its own good. From the center of the creature, you see glints of strange light, perhaps something magical? It looks like you can get some treasure if you just reach inside its... opening? However, the acid and sharp objects may hurt. Uh, lose 3 HP for a 25% chance to find a relic? That is a horrible, horribly low chance. That's basically lose 3 HP and 3... no, it's, it's terrible. You decide to leave the area. The slime pays no attention content with its meal. Yeah, that, that's beyond terrible odds. Like, I ain't gambling that much. I mean, it is just 3 HP, but still. Draw two cards, so awesome. And wait, this doesn't exhaust either? Dude, if we replaced all of our defense with backflips... Profit. Cultist. So we'll hit with that, and then we'll hit with this, and then we'll backflip. So the backflip gets back into the deck. Or something. And we have two more cards. Incantation. Ritual. Weekend wears off. They have three feathers. I don't know what three feathers does. They will do six damages. But I will also do six damages. And I prevent their six damages. They will do zero. And they will like it. After I do an additional six... And they took three. Very good. Oh, the sword. The sword is a permanent increase to their damage. Oh, is there no way to remove that? That means I'll have 12 next turn. That could get really scary really fast. So we will do the damages. And then do the damages. Oh, that didn't give them a shield. That was probably a mechanic of the other enemy then. I will then defend. Meaning we will only take one damages, but they will take three. Left with one HP. I will then hopefully have an attack card. I had an attack card. Twenty golders. What? What was that? Okay, I guess it double tapped. Hopefully that was a cool card. Draw one card, discard one card. It wasn't. Oh, wait! It was. It's zero cost. I was like, wow, that's terrible. Nah, that's okay. What are the shrooms? What does shroom do? I need better damaging cards. Ah, uh, they do six damage. But now they don't. Is there a reason to do this? Uh, get ready to defend. No, I wanted to use this, didn't I? Oh, okay. Nah, this is pointless. Because I won't have energy. Whatever. We're done. They're all going to the discard anyway. And it wasn't an exhaust card. They will take three damages. Okay, so we definitely want to keep killing this one since that one's going to do some kind of weird debuff. And this will prevent all damages. Okay, so that rat's basically dead. Oh, they got strength. Ooh. That one doesn't matter as much. We can start hitting the other one, then. Six. Six is pretty worthwhile, honestly. Now, drawing two cards now would be pointless. I do have one left over. Let's use Prepared now. I have a Strike. The Strike would be more useful. I'll get rid of this uh, Defend. It's not as good. I'll use a Strike. I'll take three damage. But they will also take three damage when they hit me. Leaving them with eight. We will kill this one. 
And we'll stab that one. And we'll use this just because we can. Oh, that's a lot of strength. Too bad it doesn't matter. Gold. A poi six poison. If that's six damage, then five damage, then four damage, etc., like a factorial, that, that'd be pretty cool, actually. Sucker Punch. Apply seven damage, apply one weak. So they do less damage. That is more than my other damage. That's very cool, and it's only one. Deal four damage whenever you draw this card. Add a copy of it into your hand. Exhaust. What? Oh, so just every time you draw it, it does four damage, but it just keeps putting itself back in the deck. That seems pointless. Why wouldn't they just not have it be exhaust? I don't understand well enough. I want weak. We got an elite battle. Metallicize. Oh, we could be in problems. Is that eight armor each turn? I might be unable to do enough damage. It does appear to be sleeping. The Talicize has worn off. Oh, okay, we just needed to do that damage one time, and it is disoriented. And these are all pointless. Oh my god, 18 damage. So, boosh. Yeah, we're just gonna take lots of damage. There's, there's no ifs, ands, or buts about that. 12 damage is gonna be the first big damage we take. I mean, at least they took a bunch of damage too, but jeez. Get neutralized. Oh, cool, they stack. That's probably just for two turns instead of one, and not 50% more damage, but I don't know. Discard one card, draw one card. I'm pretty happy with six damage. I think this might be as far as we go. Really? Really? We have nothing but defense cards on a turn when it's not going to attack us. Oh my god, dude. Now we do less damage? Oh, and all cards block one last. We are in many problems right now. They will still take three from this, but we will still take six. I don't think we have a build within which can do enough damage. Oh my god, that stuff is still there. Weakened is at 13. Weakened is still at 13. Alright, discard that one. And use that. We'll take two damage, they'll take three damage. Good, they still have one more out, but the weekend's wasted. Mech. Deal five damage. We're going to use this. Get rid of the defend. So that we can attack again. I don't see any reason to use that. Or that. We're okay. That is catastrophically bad, and that we don't appear to have a way to fix it. We're gonna have no defense, and we're not gonna be able to kill him in time. There's, there's, there's no coming back from this. Wow, did we really do that bad that we lost this soon? So we got weakened. Actually, we should've used the... Oh, no, wait. That was zero cost. We didn't lose anything. So... 
Sucker Bunch to keep the weaken up and do the maximum amount of damage that we could possibly do right now, and we will die if we don't... Oh no, these are only three. Oh my god, those are only three. With our damage permanently nerfed, there is no way this can be done. This costs zero. So we will do that. To get four more damage. And even if I use another one. You know what? Let's use it. Maybe we'll get... No, we didn't get the zero cost weaken one. We could have gotten one more point of damage hypothetically, but I guess this is okay. I can't do 16 points of damage in one turn. We died. Hmm, but this is... No, they literally only have to do one damage. They literally only have to do one damage. We, we can't win. That was as good as we were getting, Chief. Mission failed. So very fast. So very conquered. Unlock? Cards unlocked. Deal 7 damage if the enemy has poison. Deal 7 damage again. 14 damage for 1 and a use for poison. Double the enemy's poison and exhaust. And apply 6 poison when the enemy dies. Deal damage equal to its max HP to all enemies. Yo, what? That could actually be huge. These un unlocked cards will show up in future runs. New character. 